Hey guys, welcome to our uh, nursery here on uh, Salt Spring Island in the Southern Gulf Islands, Banana Joe's uh, Palm Nursery. I always get a lot of people ask me about banana plants. Do we sell banana plants? And the answer to your question is no, we grow banana plants. My nickname is Banana Joe, and I've had that nickname for a long time. Locals gave that to me moons ago. So uh, it is Banana Joe's Palm Nursery. So we uh, specialize in Trachycarpus palms. We have Trachycarpus fortuni, uh, locally grown which are Chinese windmill palms, uh, locally harvested seed from right here on Salt Spring Island. We also have Trachycarpus hybrid palms. You can see our display gardens. We do have banana uh, in our display gardens. Most of Baju, I've been growing bananas since the 1980s, but we don't sell them. If you want them, you gotta go to the big box stores or go to the nurseries here on Salt Spring Island. They do sell most of Baju bananas. We also sell Sable Minor palms and uh, from a good ecotype. So we have those as well. They're in smaller pots. But uh, our palms uh, range in size from um, one gallon to five gallons. So we have ones, twos, and fives. And uh, the prices are uh, right here when you come to the nursery. We don't have a website. We are here on YouTube, of course, Facebook. Uh, you can probably find us on Instagram because I do post pictures on Instagram, Twitter, and uh, MeWe too. But uh, I post a lot of other things on MeWe. So if you're on Salt Spring Island uh, by appointment, uh, give us a call or a uh, email at bananajoatellus.net or look for the sign out on the road. If you see our sign out on the road, we're definitely open and uh, come through the big gates. I'll grab the camera in a minute and I'll show you what we do grow for when you uh, are over here looking for a palm tree. We have hundreds and hundreds of palm trees here and uh, lots in our display garden. So you can see what we grow here with no fuss uh, on Salt Spring Island. They are uh, fully hardy here on the Gulf Islands proven track record here on the southwest coast of British Columbia, especially near the ocean. They are a long-term plant. The farther you get away from the ocean, well, in a bad winter, they might need a bit of help. So uh, anyway, guys, let me grab this and just show you what I am talking about. All right, you look for that. There's the double gates. Sign will be out there. And uh, let's just have a look-see at the uh, palm trees. We grow here, there's some hybrids in there. It's like a palm jungle. There's no shortage of palm trees here, folks. There are, I'm gonna say thousands of palm trees on this property, thousands. They're everywhere, They're growing with the native vegetation. Uh, and these are our seed grown. They're popping up everywhere, all right? You can never have enough palm trees, folks. You know that? You can never have enough palms. So these are the one gallon ones. And I'm gonna fertilize them right now with a slow release. Those are liners, those are not for sale. I try not to sell those. We put those into the bigger pots that we grow those on. Uh, five gallon size up there, Trachycarpus fortuni. There's the pot sizes. Uh, there's a six inch or half gallon, sorry, half gallon, one gallon, two gallon, and five gallons on the top. More palms there. And uh, up here, we have more of these ones we just potted up this year. So those are all Trachycarpus wagnerianus we're growing on. There are thousands in the greenhouse. These are two gallons here. Lots of two gallon palms, nice and healthy, and they stay out all winter long, all right? These palms, the only mulch they get is around the pots. Those are from zone 8A. And uh, like I say, you'll always find a Trachycarpus palm tree here for sale. And uh, like I say, give us a shout if you're in the market for a windmill palm tree locally grown here on Salt Spring Island. Nice, tough palm trees. I try to collect seed from palms with stiffer fronds and uh, ones that have stood the test of time, that's for sure. There's some beautiful old palm trees on Salt Spring Island that date back into the 1960s. All right, so we're located on the very northern end of Salt Spring Island, British Columbia, Canada. All right, guys, thanks for watching and uh, like and subscribe for more videos here. And before I uh, shut my pie hole, let me just go into the greenhouse here and show you what we've got. Lots of sable miners, okay? Sable miners and just a whole bunch of stuff in here. So uh, ask me to come in here. This is basically private propagation greenhouse, but if you want a sable miner, uh, these guys here are about 10 bucks a pot, four inch good ecotype, all right? Okay guys, take care. Happy palm growing. Cheers.